Hey there, welcome back. Today I'm really excited to be trying out for the first time a Matter Threads device. So this is the EVE motion sensor. I've seen a lot of people playing around with these devices, trying to connect them to Home Assistant without much luck. So let's have a go. So Thread is a communication protocol which is connected via Matter. The beauty of Thread is that it creates a mesh network similar to Zigbee. So the EVE motion sensor is definitely not cheap, but one of the things that I really like about it is the fact that it is waterproof, so I can use this outside to turn on my security lights. The packaging of this product gives you a feeling that it is a quality device. You can see on the side here that we've got Apple Home, SmartThings, Alexa, and Google Home. So having a look at the sensor itself, it feels like a nice quality plastic. On the front here, we've got our PIR sensor and we've got our light or lux sensor at the top here. One thing I like about this device, we've got this little status LED that can be controlled if you download the app. Um, on the back side, we've got the battery compartment. So there we go, you can see it's using two AAAs. And on the bottom side, we've got our Matter QR pairing code. So for my thread connection, I'm going to be using the border router, which is in my Apple HomePod mini. So to add this to Home Assistant, I went along to settings, devices and services, add matter device, and then I went along and scanned the QR code. It went into this mode where it was trying to connect, but it literally did absolutely nothing. I left it for about three or four minutes and nothing at all. I repeatedly tried connecting it directly to Home Assistant, but there was no chance. It just hung there every time and would not connect. So I decided to give it another try with a different route. I thought I would try connecting it to Apple HomeKit first and then sharing it from Apple HomeKit over to Home Assistant. So I went along to Apple HomeKit, pressed the plus key and set it into adding a new device. Opened it up. It then scanned the QR code on the EVE sensor and once again it went into a mode of trying to connect. It did take a while but eventually it connected and was up and running in Apple HomeKit. Now I went back to Home Assistant and tried to add a Matter device but this time I said it's already in use and I said it's being used on Apple Home and what it asked me now is for a setup code. Now I went back to the device in Apple HomeKit and I said turn on pairing mode. Once it did this, it came up with a code that I could copy over and use in Home Assistant. I pasted this code into Home Assistant. It took a while, but eventually it connected and I finally had my thread device showing up in Home Assistant. So I now had my Eve device showing with all of its details here inside of Home Assistant. As you can see, we've got our illuminance showing really nicely, graphing it there. We've got our occupancy coming through, no problems at all. We've got this identify button. If you press that, it flashes the little red LED. We're also bringing in our battery level 100% and our battery voltage. So that was quite a mission, but at least I got it working in the end. I'm sure you're all hoping that Home Assistant can get this thread system working so that we don't have to go via other devices. But anyway, that's all for now. Hope you've enjoyed this video. Please let me know in the comments below what your experience has been with thread, if you've tried any of the devices, and if you've liked this video, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.